Among the hundreds of different types of mushrooms, one that often raises eyebrows thanks to its super shimmering and kind of jelly and squishy appearance uh, is the snow mushroom, or as it's also known, the tremellan mushroom. In our discussion today, we're going to really dive into this peculiar but super fascinating mushroom, exploring its remarkable ability to enhance skin hydration and cognitive function. And despite its unusual appearance, the tremella mushroom is a powerhouse of benefits, really proving that sometimes the most extraordinary wellness allies can come in the most unexpected forms. Here's the tremella mushroom, jiggly jiggly, you can see it. They are found in the wild, growing on dead or fallen branches of broadleaf trees. They have a widespread presence, thriving in more warmer climates across the globe, especially in Asia, the tropics, or even some regions of North America. Identifying tremella mushrooms in their natural habitat is really an experience into itself. If you're looking for their signature white to pale yellow, almost kind of like a real lobe that seem to glow along the forest floor. But it's not just their beauty that captures the heart. It's their resilience and ability to adapt. Tremella mushrooms absorb moisture from their surroundings, flourishing even in environments where other fungi might struggle. This remarkable characteristic is not just an inspirational metaphor, but also a clue to their incredible benefits for our health. Tremella mushrooms contain several compounds that have been evaluated for their health benefits, and we're gonna dive into those next. Tremella mushrooms, this guy right here, contain polysaccharides, specifically a type called gluconoxylomanenin. You know what? We're just going to call it G and I'll put it on the screen for you. I cannot pronounce this compound for the life of me. Anyways, these complex sugars really play a pivotal role in tremella's hydrating properties. It can draw moisture into the skin, much like hyaluronic acid does. And this is why tremella is often hailed as the like natural hyaluronic acid. It can provide really deep hydration to the skin from the inside out. But their benefits really extend beyond just skin hydration. These polysaccharides also support immune function, helping your body's defenses stay robust and responsive. And they also contain a variety of vitamins and minerals essential for our health. Vitamin D, for instance, is crucial for bone health and immune function. And tremella mushrooms are one of the few non-animal sources of this important nutrient. Additionally, they provide a spectrum of other nutrients, including selenium, zinc, and magnesium, each playing a crucial role in maintaining our body's health and vitality. It's important to remember that it's not just about the compounds themselves though, but it's also about how they work together to really bring harmony into our body. All right, so what does science say? Now we're gonna take a closer look at the evidence available to us, but let's also recognize that the data is really not as robust as it could be for now. We need some more research on tremella mushrooms. One of the more robust studies on tremella conducted by Bon et al. and published in the Journal of Medicinal Food demonstrated that individuals consuming tremella showed improvements in memory and cognitive functions compared to those in a placebo group. The research focused on individuals who while not diagnosed with cognitive diseases, reported feeling their memory wasn't as sharp as it used to be. And this is also kind of known as subjective cognitive impairment. The study engaged 75 participants, each experiencing some level of subjective cognitive impairment, creating a relatable scenario for many of us as we age. Over an eight week period, the research was structured as a randomized double blind placebo controlled trial, which is a gold standard for scientific studies. Participants were divided into to three groups. Group number one received a lower dose of tremella extract at 600 milligrams per day. Another higher dose, 1200 milligrams per day of tremella extract was group number two. And then the last group received a placebo, setting the stage for really a comprehensive evaluation of tremella. The primary focus was on any changes in participants' self-reported memory components. 
measured through a detailed questionnaire. Secondary outcomes included assessments of short-term memory and executive functions, testing using standardized cognitive tests to really gauge the extract's broader cognitive benefits, and participants taking Tremella, regardless of the dose, reported improvements in their subjective memory complaints compared to the placebo group. But beyond just feeling better, they also performed better on tests measuring short-term memory and executive function. While these findings suggest that Tremella could play a role in boosting cognitive function and slowing cognitive decline, the self-reported nature of the study prevents ubiquitous application of the results. Another study suggests that this mushroom may really protect against cognitive decline, including conditions like Alzheimer's disease and mild cognitive impairment. One study published in Microbiology by Park et al. in 2007 highlighted that a hot water extract from Melopisiformis could significantly reduce the toxicity caused by beta amyloid peptide, a substance associated with Alzheimer's disease, and which is pretty toxic. While this suggests that Tremella could serve as a preventative agent against neurodegenerative diseases, this study was done in vitro and does require some more evidence to substantiate the claim. All right, what about skin health? When it comes to skin health, the benefits of Tremella are equally compelling. A study by Shen et al. in 2017 in Molecular Medicine Reports found that Tremella fusiformis polysaccharide could alleviate oxidative stress and prevent apoptosis in skin fibroblasts, suggesting a role in treating oxidative stress-associated skin diseases and aging. Similarly, research published in the journal of functional foods by Wen et al. in 2016 showed that polysaccharides from Tremella could reduce skin damage caused by UV radiation, including water and collagen loss, hinting really at its potential as a functional food supplement for skin protection. But let's take a step back on this research. It is really important that these promising findings were derived from in vitro studies, i.e. experiments conducted outside of a living organism, typically in a lab dish. Therefore, when these results, they are promising, but they shouldn't be directly applied to human health without further research. But nevertheless, these studies do lay a solid foundation or groundwork and are likely to inspire future research aimed at validating Jamela's skin health benefits in human trials. All right, so while modern science has not rigorously evaluated tremella mushrooms, traditional Chinese medicine has used it for centuries, not just as a food, particularly in soup form, but as a form of medicine. Its historical significance in Chinese culture is both profound and really enlightening, offering us some insights into the wisdom of an ancient wellness in traditional Chinese medicine, Tremella fusiformis, also known as Bai Mu Er or white wood beer, is celebrated for its rejuvenating properties, those traditionally consumed for its beauty enhancing benefits, leading to promote a radiant complexion and maintain youthful skin. But Tremella's use was not limited to cosmetic purposes. It was also valued for its deep nourishing properties, particularly for the lungs, stomach, and kidneys. This aligns with the holistic approach of traditional Chinese medicine, where the focus is on nurturing the whole body in its entirety, promoting balance and harmony within. The lore of Tremella stretches back to the Tang Dynasty, where it was reserved for royalty and the elite. It was believed that consuming Tremella could extend longevity and enhance overall vitality, a belief that modern research has begun to validate by highlighting the antioxidants properties of this mushroom. Beyond its health benefits, Tremella holds a special place in Chinese culture for its culinary versatility. It's got this like subtle, sweet flavor and like a really unique gelatinous texture that makes it a beloved ingredient in soups and even in desserts. Like imagine a Tremella jello. And this kind of brings us to my favorite part of these episodes, which is how to use Tremella in daily life. I'll meet you in the kitchen. Hey guys, I am so excited to share with you a recipe for tremella mushroom soup, which is not only delicious and nourishing, but has some deep historical roots within Chinese culinary tradition. But that's only one way that you can consume tremella, this like beautiful, luscious and juicy, you can see uh, mushroom here. Uh, you can also consume it as a supplement. And I'm gonna give you some guidance on that too. So let's dive right in. First with supplements. If you are going to be taking tremella and just taking it every day, culinary in a soup, 
isn't your jam, then taking in a trusted supplement is one way to go. Um, buy a powder or in a capsule format. The one thing that you wanna be making sure when you're taking any sort of supplement is that you are consuming the fruiting body. And I have a lot of videos on what the difference between a fruiting body and mycelium and why it matters. And I'll link those in the description below. But basically that fruiting body is this top part of the mushroom that you can see and you have all of those beneficial compounds that you're wanting to get for uh, all the health benefits that we've been talking about. So, um, you know, make sure that you're consuming the fruiting body of the mushroom and it should say that on the supplement facts panel. Then also make sure that you are consuming a mushroom that has a standardized um, polysaccharide or beta glucan extract. And I'll link to why that's important down below. So this is a tremella mushroom soup recipe and it's a traditional recipe that's been used for centuries in Chinese culture. In Chinese culture, tremella is prized for making sure that you have beautiful skin, really helping with that like bouncy, kind of clear, beautiful skin that um, everyone wants. And so this recipe includes tremella. We've also got some lotus flower seeds that I've been soaking overnight. I've been soaking the tremella as well and some red jujube dates. I've also been soaking. So um, I will put on the screen just what these look like and we'll dive right in with making this delicious soup. So here are all of our ingredients. We've got some lotus seeds. We have um, some jujube dates, tremella mushrooms, and some goji berries, an Asian pear, and some honey. All right, so this is a traditional tremella mushroom soup, and it's like a super comforting and nourishing dish that's perfect for any time of year, um, especially during the cooler and kind of drier months. What I'm doing right now is, well, the tremella has soaked for a little bit, and I am separating it out, trimming it into some bite-sized pieces, uh, just so that it's easier to consume in the soup. Like, and what you really wanna do, which I'm gonna do a little bit later, is discard any of those hard bits that you see on the bottom here. Um, all right, so now we've got a stock pot with enough water, and I'm going to be inputting all of those trimmed tremella pieces inside. What we'll be doing is adding the tremella as well as all of the jujube dates that we have, the red one, and letting that, bring that to a boil, and then letting it simmer. All right, so this has been simmering for a little bit and we're going to add in the remaining ingredients. We've got the lotus seeds here. And remember, these lotus seeds have been, um, the centers have been removed. Next, we're going to add in a little bit of sweetness. So this Asian pear. And this is just 30 minutes before you're ready to finish cooking. You're gonna add in the lotus seeds and the cubed pears. Um, you could also use apples if you don't happen to have access to Asian pears. Um, this step adds a lovely, really subtle sweetness and enhances the soup's hydrating properties. Then just before you take the soup off the heat, you're going to let this go for 30 minutes and then you'll add the goji berries. They really soften in the soup and can like add like a burst of color. They're also super antioxidant rich, so really like a nice addition. Then if you like your soup with a hint of sweetness, you can add honey. I'm not going to. In my particular case, I think that the pear and apple is really good already, but it's really up to your choice. All right, so this tremella soup can be enjoyed warmed or chilled. It offers a host of benefits from the skin plumping and hydration from the tremella mushroom, as well as the antioxidants from the jujube and the goji berries they're adding in here. You know, if you're seeking extra hydration, the addition of the pears and apples can help like, soothe dry coughs and itchy throats. And so this soup is really a good ally for your overall wellness. All right, that's all that I have for you guys today. I hope this was a super lovely and informative video on tremella mushrooms. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.